Take care of all of our roosters that have been have been being produced, all the chicks that have become roosters, and now we're having so many, you know, uh, roosters crowing in the mornings. It's getting an annoying. And today we're gonna have the kids um, clean up the roosters. We're gonna kill those, clean them up, and we're gonna put some meat in the freezer. So hopefully you guys stay tuned to watch. This is reality. This is what it's like living on a farm. All right, let's get into uh, butchering up some chickens. So we've already caught four roosters and we're gonna catch the rest of them. Now, let's see. Get out this way. I got the first one. Now get a rooster. Eli, that one, that one, Val, get him, get him, Val, get him, Val, get him. All right, All right. come on, Val. Here get him, Val, get him. All right, got him. Linda, here, right here. Got him. Yeah. So we got uh, the first one by myself. Yeah. yeah. I got big ones right here. These two big ones. Back, back, back. All right. You come jump in the, the neighbor's yard. And we're going to get you. Go, 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 guys. All right, guys, let's go clean them up. All right. All right. All right, guys, so first first step is to catch all the chickens. We got them all, and we actually put a little zip tie, zip tie their legs together. We laid them in here, okay? So they're just chilling. <laughs> kind of chilling. Val's checking them out. And uh, we're gonna get the ice ready, get the knives ready, get the pot of water so we can pluck them. And uh, all the kids are ready to pluck some chickens, so. Let's get to making some chicken.
good? All right. Yep. Thank you. You're welcome. Yummy. Limeade, made by the kiddos. Boys, mom made some limeade. <clears throat> Ooh, that one looks really good. Good job. Put them in the cooler. All right, guys. Well, <laughs> you love chicken cleaning day, baby? It's all right. It gets <laughs> it done. That's part of having chickens, guys, is actually having to clean them up and when they reproduce. And you get lots of hens, you get lots of eggs. But when you get lots of roosters, you got to do something with them. And uh, we're too cheap to give them away, so we're gonna clean them up and eat them. Nobody wants roosters. <laughs> no one, yeah, no one wants uh, non-egg-laying uh, animals. They're, that reminds me of a joke. So, a rooster lands on a roof. The wind is going 30 miles an hour to the east. If he lays an egg, which way does it go? East or west? The rooster doesn't lay eggs. That's correct. <laughs> but Eli didn't know that. He was like, was like 30 miles an hour. <laughs> Got all the chicken. Val, stop licking the chicken. So, cut off all the chicken's feet and a couple necks. You may not understand this. You may not eat chicken feet. But South America, a lot of those countries in South America actually eat chicken feet. A lot of people eat chicken feet. And uh, so my neighbor, I give them fish and everything, and I'm going to see if they want the chicken feet. We'll see if they like them. I'm pretty sure they do because I've given them to them before. So we're going to go over here and see if, uh, if they want some chicken feet. Now, we don't, he doesn't speak English very well, so sometimes it's kind of hard for us to communicate. But we, we make do. ¿Qué pasa? Chicken feet! Chicken feet! Chicken feet! Fresh! From my chicken! Okay, okay? Okay. I see you! I'll see you! Bye! Okay, boys! Alright. Chicken feet are offloaded and uh, time to get back to our chickens. Well, we got all the chicken seasoned up and wrapped up, and we're gonna go put them on the smoker. Let's go. So I'm gonna put that rack on there. All 
All right, guys, well, we just got the chicken off the grill. All the bags of chicken. They've been smoke. They've been in the smoker for about three hours now. About about three hours, maybe a little, maybe about four hours. But they're all done. They reached over 165, just slightly over. So now we're gonna go ahead and take them out of the foil, get them cooled off, bagged up, and uh, save them for later. Just looks amazing. That bone is being separated right there. And we want a cool Mary one. Lavender rosemary. That looks yummy. That's one of those lavender ones. Look, the meat mm -hmm. is just falling off the bones. Mm -hmm. Oh my goodness. Those chickens did not die in vain. <laughs> Look at that, guys. That looks amazing to me. I got a mess here, but I want to dig into this chicken. Guys, thank you so much for watching this episode where we taught our kids how to clean pork. We, uh, we butchered a, a pig from, from uh, we raised him. I mean, our neighbors raised him, fed him. We butchered him to feed us. We, uh, we've got some ribs and stuff that we're gonna be cooking. Then we butchered all our roosters. The kids helped pluck them all. We've cleaned them up, we've cooked them, and I'm gonna try to eat this, and we're gonna get back to you. Make sure you guys subscribe, follow us, share our channel with all your friends, all right? Oh my gosh, I'm so glad.